Hello dear ones, this is B. I'm back to talk a little bit about some of the things that I notice in my own life or in my surroundings. And as we are all confronted with so much information and so many strong emotions um, that are coming up within us and all around us, um, when we seek information, when we try to find clarity, when we try to find out what's going on and maybe looking on the internet or, yeah, on the internet very often, trying to find to read about something or watch a video or whatever to find clarity and see what others feel, think or say. There is often used that term, um, take what resonates. I like that a lot and I use it at times as well when I uh, post something, a video or a written a written um, message or sharing. And um, yeah, what I mean by that is, does it resonate with you? Does it feel like, oh yeah, oh, oh yeah, oh, oh yeah, I, oh that's true. Oh, that's, that's right. Yeah, I've been thinking about this as well. It happens often to me that I read something, that I listen to something, and I feel like, yeah, I agree with this, and oh God, yeah, it makes so much sense. And then again, like, I'm, but I don't know about that. I don't know about that. I'm not really sure. And I have lear learned to appreciate this kind of variation within that time space that I'm reading an article or a listen to the message in a in one of the, the videos because it shows me that in certain areas I have very similar experiences or I interpret my experiences in a similar way that makes sense to me uh, or else I I feel like hmm maybe that's for the other person but not for me like I it doesn't really mean anything to me I can't really understand even what that means. And um, I realized today, I, I, I do understand that much better, that we go through phases at different stages as humans. And sometimes something that doesn't resonate with me, much later suddenly makes sense. Or like, ah, this is what they meant. Ah, this is what they said when they felt this and this, or when they had this and this experience. So in order to experience this and even these aha moments and these moments of, oh, I resonate or I, I don't know about that. That means that we have a level of awareness to discern between different notions, feelings, emotions that arrive within us. So we feel out, yeah, oh, yeah, that makes sense. Because it's always about emotions, about things that come up emotionally, feelings. And we try to make sense of it with our intellectual mind. And this is how we <laughs> explain everything to ourselves. So to use that instrument, like this kind of feeling and this kind of, when someone says it or types it in and says, take what resonates and leave the rest. Maybe try to go in with that kind of, oh, I, w I try that. I don't know what it means, but maybe I try. Maybe do that and see whether you find these different things within a message, a sentence or a paragraph or a whole post. And if you do, just you know, stop and, 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 and take it in for a moment. Oh yeah, that feels so right, you know. And then go to the next and say, oh yeah, that too, but then the next thing, I don't know about that. Maybe. And realize how fine tuning works for you. So you actually really do what musicians do in an orchestra. They're all sitting there and playing their instruments and trying to find that resonance so that they all 
Indians sit in harmony. I'm not saying when you listen or read something, you should find, trying to find the harmony in all of this. I don't think that is the point. The point is to find out that I can, I have an instrument. My body is my instrument. My body is capable of feeling these emotions. You know, the kind of feeling that people say, I feel stick, sick in my stomach. Oh, that's because of an emotion. It's like energetically straight into your belly. So that's your instrument where you feel all this. Oh, my heart opened. That's here. Okay. So loads of things. I just want to encourage you to use your body as an instrument to find resonance or not non-resonance. It, it's not about finding resonance all the time. No, not at all. I've learned loads and loads of things from, from people who did not resonate with me or books that I read or videos or life experiences that were the opposite of resonance. Absolute opposite. It was like, no, this is not my world. This is not who I am. This is not what I want. So I could feel out what is resonant with my instrument, with my being, with my physical body that I have here in this reality to experience me as a soul expression of the all there is, of the divine, whatever you call it, creation. But this body, this human body has that ability. And that's where we can say, oh, that resonates. Oh, that doesn't. I just want to have that quick, quick chat about resonance. Okay. Thank you. Bye-bye.